I mean, my take on, you know what I mean, the, the, the violence of the youth, I mean, first and foremost, you know what I mean, we got to understand that we don't have any role models. So people want to emulate, especially in the urban areas, this gangster type of an act. And it just kind of mind boggles me how people are killing each other for like less than nothing. Like, you know what I mean, two weeks ago, my man called me and said that this 14 year old shot this other guy in the head for 50 cents. You know what I'm saying? So. My thing is, is that, you know, as the youth, for the youth, I believe that it just needs to be more role models advocating something more than just violence. I mean, it's one thing to be masculinity and hold your own, you know what I mean? But it's another thing when you're just killing people for no reason or killing each other for a color when, to be honest, we don't even own the color that we're, that we're repping and we don't own the block that we say that we have. You see what I'm saying? So it got to be a bigger thing. I mean, if you want to kill something, you'll kill it on Wall Street and get this real money. If you want to really kill something, you know what I'm saying, really, like, you know, be intricate and do certain ways. Like, for example, in jail, like, I mean, I, I mean, like, you got a lot of brothers that, like, make different type of knives to kill each other. They can't even read and write. But if they could take that same ingenuity and do something totally different and flip it on a positive level or just try to get this money, you know what I mean, it's going to be all good. But the rules have definitely changed and the drugs have too. So, you know, that's what it is.